Hey everyone, it's Flackfire. Battlefield 1's new French-themed DLC, They Shall Not Pass, includes a brand new elite pickup, the Trench Raider. The Trench Raider is a close quarters specialist. Wielding the brutal Raider Club, this elite can cut through the enemy team like butter. There's no drawn-out melee animation, so this new elite is a serious threat. In addition to his massive melee weapon, the Trench Raider also has access to an arsenal of fragmentation and smoke grenades. Interestingly, the Trench Raider also has the ability to do more than just attack enemies. He can heal himself and his team with a medical crate. The Trench Raider also comes equipped with a sidearm, the six-shot number three revolver. To maximize the potential of the Trench Raider, remember that hitting the melee button will automatically deploy the Raider Club, so keep your pistol equipped for longer-range engagements. Although the Trench Raider is a close quarter specialist, it doesn't mean he's invincible. He might seem overpowered because of the medical crate, but having spent some time playing as the Trench Raider, I'd actually say he's quite squishy. Aside from being vulnerable at range, melee attacks or bayonet charges will still put him down, so keep this in mind if you see him approaching. In the two new operations included in They Shall Not Pass, the Trench Raider and other elites appear instead of a behemoth on the infantry focus maps Verdun Heights and Fort DeVoe. Sticking close to bullet sponges like the Sentry, for example, may help you close the distance to enemies for more productive assaults. The Trench Raider is also great fun on Conquest, so be sure to give it a go when They Shall Not Pass drops for Battlefield 1. What are your thoughts on the Trench Raider? Tell me in the comments. If you enjoyed this video, leave a like, share our websites like Facebook and Twitter, and of course, subscribe. As always, thanks for watching.